Storm Shield weather, certified most accurate. Hi everyone, I'm Storm Shield meteorologist Brandon Woolley and some severe weather to talk about for this afternoon and early this evening, much more active today compared to what we experienced yesterday on your Saturday. Zooming down on Storm Shield Doppler radar, this is a severe thunderstorm warning still in effect until 530, uh, just to the east of Pryor, and also a flash flood warning in throughout southwestern Osage County. That's valid until 545. Several inches of rain today fell over Osage, so a lot of thunderstorms still in our forecast out there right now. You can see from our Weatherbug Airport cam looking towards the north, very ominous looking skies, but towards the south, a little more in the way of sunshine trying to come in, some sun breaks from time to time right over the Arkansas River. 83 degrees is your current temperature after reaching the mid to the upper 80s out there for this afternoon. A very warm one and kind of uncomfortable, I must say, because the dew point right now at 71 degrees and not too much wind today except for around the showers and storms now out of the northeast, only up to about 10 miles per hour. Those current temperatures now from the 70s to the 80s, close to 90 degrees. Bartlesville with a rain shower now at 72 degrees into the upper 70s around Coffeyville, but towards the south around Eufaula, almost at 90 degrees for early this evening. The official daytime high today so far came in at 87 degrees, the average for this time of year of 83 and nothing in the bucket at the Tulsa International Airport. Timing things out on future track clouds and precipitation. So overnight tonight, partly cloudy skies, a slight chance for showers and some isolated thunderstorms, some which could turn severe. We'll definitely keep you posted on air and online if necessary. Then for tomorrow on your Monday, partly cloudy skies in kind of the same forecast, just like we experienced today. A chance for showers and some isolated thunderstorms popping up during the afternoon and early in the evening. Stay ahead of the storminess. You can download our Storm Shield weather app from the Apple App Store and also Google Play. Overnight lows tonight down into the 60s all over again with a slight chance for some of those showers and isolated thunderstorms. Variable winds between about 5 and 10 miles per hour. Tahlequah at 64 4 degrees 66 in Shakota. Variable winds between about 5 and 15. The sunrise coming up at 608. A slight chance for showers and some isolated thunderstorms for tonight. For tomorrow, here's a look at your hourly planner. Partly cloudy skies and a chance for showers mainly in the afternoon. A little bit cooler if we can find some relief with that at 83 degrees. Temperatures across the north into the 80s, including Talala at 83 degrees, Claremore at 84. Southeasterly winds between about 10 and 15. It should be quiet for the morning, but an increasing chance for showers and storms once again mid to late afternoon and in throughout the early evening. McAllister at 84 degrees, Eufaula comes in at 83 with partly cloudy skies and a chance for more of those showers. Here's a look at your latest seven day forecast. Now Tuesday through Wednesday, very heavy rain comes in and some thunderstorms and we could see some localized flooding around green country. We'll definitely keep you posted as the heavier rain comes in, knocking down that high temperature that's going to feel better at 76 degrees, but then popping up into the 80s for next weekend with mostly sunny skies and no more showers left in the forecast. No more showers. I'm sure people are glad to hear that. Next weekend looks good. All right, Brandon. Thanks. Now it's time for sports.